Johnny Walker doesn't walk around looking for someone to walk into. Okay? Um, I had to go look up what was Johnny Walker. I didn't know if it was brandy or whiskey or whatever. But anyway, I found out later. But uh, after Googling, uh, I'm not very into that. But uh, <laughs> he doesn't walk around town. This bottle of, of, of alcohol doesn't walk around town and say, Ah, oh, there's a Christian reading his Bible. There's a Christian praying. Let me just fill him quickly with my alcohol. He can't do that. All right? He, he doesn't just jump on us and overcome us. It's a choice. It's a choice. Getting drunk is a choice. And it starts with making a decision. So some people, I'm just going to use a scenario uh, because people don't always get drunk in the same place. Uh, you can get drunk anywhere. But uh, let's just use the scenario. Uh, uh, on a Friday morning, Friday afternoon, the guy says, hmm, I think it's time for a drink tonight. It starts with a decision. And then he gets into his car and he drives to a bar. And uh, in, in Frankfurt, there's a few places you can drive to, to get drunk if you want. Okay, so he drives to the bar and, and he, he takes his money with him <laughs> because he's made this decision and he drives. And then he walks into the bar and he sits down in the bar, but now sitting down in the bar doesn't make you drunk. You can sit down in the bar and drink a Coke or you can drink a glass of water or whatever you want to drink. It doesn't, sitting in the bar doesn't make you drunk, drunk. You see, the decision is to order something that can make you drunk. So you order whatever you order and, and uh, uh, they bring you the bottle or the glass or whatever they bring you and then you can sit at the table with this bottle of glass in front of you, you're still not drunk and you still don't get drunk. Just with the glass there, in the presence of the glass, doesn't make you drunk. And you see, sometimes we, we come into a service or sometimes we come into a place or sometimes the Holy Spirit works and we make a decision, but then we come in and then we just sit down at the table and then we expect. And no, no person that wants to drink expects to sit down and say, right, I'm now here, I'm going to sit and relax. All right, I want you. No, he's going to make the decision. He's going to put his hand out. He's going to take the glass. He's going to open up his mouth. And he's going to pour whatever he's drinking into his mouth. Now, when he does that, something happens inside of him. Something that he cannot explain happens. But he doesn't care. He doesn't care. Even if he can't explain what's happening, he doesn't care because it feels good. And just by the way, no one sins because it feels bad. Everybody sins because it feels good. But that's not my point. 